Welcome, my name is Matthew the Hawk, Hawk Talon, and I'm reporting to you live from the arena. Today we're going to be interviewing a few people to see why PvP is broken. So before this show gets started, let's talk about some warnings. So this show may cause hysteria, bleeding, internal bleeding, broken limbs, confusion, sadness, panic, blindness, deafness, diarrhea, aches, nausea, general pain, or even death. And that's only half the list, but I don't really care, so let's get started. Now, the first person we are going to interview is Mr. John. Mr. John, how has PvP affected you, and how long have you been playing for? My name is Mr. John. I've been PvPing since you were born, son. <coughs> and yes, I know this game has only been around for seven years. But I was PvPing before it even came out. That's how good I was. So, you know... My family, I have been putting every single hour of every single day into this game. And every single day I PvP non-stop, I tell ya. And every single day when I PvP, I wanna win, you know? I got Warlord on all 85 of my characters. I play 24-7. Everyone around me used to tell me it's a problem. But, you know, they don't talk to me anymore, so I'm pretty fine with that. Anyways, so I devoted everything, but suddenly one day King's Isle changed PvP on me. They broke PvP, and this, and this was worse than everything. Throughout my life, I had a pretty hard life. I lost my job, I lost a lot of my money, I lost my kids. But when I lost my PvP, when King's Isle broke PvP, that was the worst, the worst thing I'll tell ya. It was the worst thing ever. What are they, what are they doing? They broke my PvP. I love, I love my PvP. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm getting teary now. I, I just love it so much. But then they broke it. I kept losing. I lost Warlord. I have been wandering for so long, and, and then I lost it. <laughs> oh my gosh, I am so touched, Mr. John. Thank you for that. Now we are going to get on to our next interviewee. Uh, his name is Mr. Chuck the Chuck. Yes, my name is Chuckity Chuck to the Chuck Jr. to the Chuck. Some people just call me that. It's a longer version. I don't know why. Anyways, I want to talk mainly about critical. You know that thing that ruined PvP? You know, yeah, I want to talk about that, you know? Because I would think if I have 300 block and my opponent has 100 critical, I think I should be able to block their critical. I mean, I mean it makes sense, right? Three times more you think you block. But no, ho, 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 critical always lands on me. The criticals always land on me. And I always lose every single match. I'm a zero private because I can't win one match because of critical. It breaks in this game. I was, on the, I was the first one on the leaderboards before critical came. That's how good I was. And then when critical came, I became a zero private. I don't even know what to do. Critical ruin this game, and I'm I'm coming for you, King Style. I'm coming for you. Okay, folks, you do not want to know what he said after that. So uh, now we're gonna go on to interview Mr. Samuel, and he has to talk about PvP as well. Yeah, my name is Samuel. Yep, that's my name. And uh, yeah, so PvP, uh, it's not it's not really something I do, you know. Uh, I, I, I always like questing, you know? I quest every day, I quest through all the worlds, and, uh, I don't even PvP. So when people tell me it's broken, I just say quest, you know? Quest, quest, quest! I need some questing buddies to quest with on my questing adventures! Hey, you don't wanna quest some more? Hey, just make a new character and you can quest with me! I have 50,000 characters because every time I'm done questing, I find some more buddies and I quest a bit more because questing is all I do! Now questing, questing, questing! I love fighting the mobs, I love fighting the bosses, I love fighting the more mobs, I love fighting more bosses, I memorize the script from the storyline script 
for every single character, for every single side quest, for every single main quest, for every single world. You know why? Because I, all I do is quest. <laughs> and uh, you can join me. Now, uh, call uh, one, two, three, quest with me. If you want to quest with me, kiddos. <laughs> cut the line, cut the line. I don't even know why we had that guy in here. He was even talking about PvP. Anyways, for this last interview, we're going to have a nice and juicy one for you folks at home so today we're going to be talking to or interviewing a king's isle employee and he is the one who broke pvp he was responsible for the dark moor spells that are completely overpowered he's responsible for critical he's responsible for those random wand nay cats he's even responsible for this atrocity of a spell along with every single broken thing you can think of so now let's get right to that First off, do you think people are justified when they say PvP is broken? No, no, of course not. No one has been saying that. Interesting, but what about all the complaints you've gotten from the Wizard 101 community? Oh, my paycheck. It's not their job to tell us how to change our game. Okay then, so why'd you create Critical? Um, this is actually classified information, but I'm, I'll reveal it to you, since you guys have been pretty nice so far. So, uh, I secretly wanted to ruin Wizard 101 PvP, so everyone would start playing Pirate 101. Uh, and I personally like Pirate 101 better. I see. So, lastly, who are you going to vote for in the 2016 election? Of course, I'm gonna vote for Donald Trump! We're dying. We need- Enhance! Finish him!